What's going on guys? I got a uh, video over here of blueprints of a tank I'm going to be making for my bearded dragon. Uh, this is a 4x2x2 by two by two enclosure. Um, this is going to be sort of like a bow master, but I heard the guy is terrible to deal with. So I figured I'd make my own for cheap. So what I have here is the pricing for everything at Lowe's, which is pretty cheap. We have a uh, pine sanded plywood, $20, that's eight by four. So that'll help me with uh, only needing to buy one piece. And then we have a side, which is four by two. That's only 750. So I'm gonna cut that in half, make two by two side, cut this in half twice to make a four by two section. And then we have here the plexiglass, 48 by 24 plexiglass. And that's only $25. Here we have three of the ceramic lighting fixture, you could say. And that's gonna be $4 for those. And then you have the extension cord that you plug into the, or connect to this. And that's only gonna be $4.71 for all of those. So altogether, this enclosure is gonna be obviously four by two by two, which is basically, she does not want me to pick her up, which is basically going to be the perfect size enclosure for any bearded dragon. Um, they say, you know, the 40 gallon breeders are awesome for bearded dragons, but some bearded dragons get very big, so they don't really fit in them. And I like to give her as much space as she needs. As you can see here, she doesn't have a lot of space. And I'm selling this to my friend anyway, so if you to buy one or build one. Um, this is the pricing at Home Depot. $20, $10, $27 for the plexiglass, $4 for that. It's basically the same pricing. Uh, so altogether for all those supplies, it's going to be $67.42. So I'm going to be making that enclosure. Uh, again, it looks just like a bow master. These, this was an option for a top, is to just cut the circles and have the lamps coming up from the top. But, um, Obviously not gonna do that. So I'm gonna go with this option here. Um, comment and subscribe on the video if you liked it, and if you have any suggestions of different wood I could use, uh, that'd be great. Thanks.